And to mix metaphors, th these are the pieces of the puzzle. When we can get the security part in place, that enables all of the other things to happen. Schools to be built, uh, immunization programs to take hold, infrastructure, and public confidence amongst the Afghans. This is what we're hearing that is starting to be a pivot point where the Afghans themselves are feeling confident that the Taliban are not coming back. Uh, and so what better wish could anyone have for Christmas and for the new year that we are starting to see a fragile, albeit, uh, but solid peace start to develop here in southern Afghanistan. But in terms of coming back, uh, this will be our Middle East, and they'll continue to serve Canadians at home. And uh, that's what makes me so very proud when I see the work that they're doing uh, firsthand when you have an opportunity to talk to them and to feel that pride and purpose that they feel as members of the Canadian Forces and to see the very practical, uh, pragmatic change that they've made to a country like Afghanistan. You can't help but feel proud as a Canadian. is really important though is is that the uh, briefing we just got uh, demonstrated that Canada had the leadership by recognizing the importance of community development councils where the Afghans themselves are making the decisions for their people that coming summer yes they will the Della Dam the first phase of the Della Dam will be finished we are proceeding on the construction of our schools it was just reported that uh, we've completed three more schools since our last quarterly report. The polio eradication, we're continuing on with the uh, vaccination program.